Waking up this morning, I smile. 24 brand new hours are before me. I vow to live fully in each moment and look at all beings with eyes of compassion. Oh, gosh. Good morning. This quote helps me be mindful throughout my day. And one of the first things I do is look in this mirror to remind myself that I'm still here and I still got it. Still got it. <laughs> My philosophy for skin is that good skin starts from within. So I like to start my day with this alkaline water, 9.5. Really keeps me hydrated. This is my favorite glass to drink out of. It's actually a wine glass, but I'm more of a water girl. And um, it's pretty funny because it's like, while I'm drinking it, I'm actually licking people off, so. I love you though, so it's okay. These are my babies. We have Buddha, Michon. He's like the model. Buddha is like the chill cat. And Grammy, somewhere around here. She's my baby. She's the girl. This is Grammy. I love that they purr. I've heard that purring is actually like a healing, a healing vibration. <laughs> All three of my cats were from fosters that I had and I just fell in love with them. So I was like, I have to keep a few of them. <laughs> Okay, my tea is ready. Yes, yes. I like to start my day with a nice hot cup of tea. I like to collect mugs. Let's see. I think I'm gonna go with a cup of happy because I want to be happy today. I also collect teas. I'm gonna go with a stress relief. Yo, this is my favorite tea because of the little sayings that they have on. Compassion will make you beautiful. That's very sweet. I try to stick to teas more than like coffee or anything that has like a lot of caffeine in it. Especially when I'm singing, throat coat is my favorite tea. Or when I'm singing, my Manuka honey. I can't have my tea without it. Okay, this is my studio. And these are my instruments. It took me a while to understand that one of my purposes as an artist is to help aid people in the healing process. And so I've just been studying how sound can be a form of healing. And I'm incorporating these healing instruments into the music so that I can really put that intention into my music to, to heal. This is one of my favorites. This is a crystal singing bowl in the key of C, which helps balance the root chakra. Okay. You can only play this if you have a pure heart. So let's see if my heart is pure today. It's not pure today. Hold on. A few months ago, I started doing readings on myself and others. Ooh, okay, I've never gotten this card before. I don't know the cards by heart yet. I'm still, you know, 
in training. This book, Tarot Made Easy, will help me understand why I got this card for the month of March. My question had to do with love, <laughs> like they usually do every month. Okay, you wish things weren't so hard and or you want to become less emotional or reactive. Wow, that's very true. And to be able to throw off or cut off anyone or anything that could elicit a negative emotional response. You will experience a lot of vacillation in matters of the heart and will be looking for the right approach or the right mate. Or you will have so many other things on your mind that love will be the furthest thing from it. Wow, okay. All right, I hear you, I hear you. Really, it's just like guidance for the month. I have five decks. I have a tarot deck, a goddess deck, an animal deck, an angel deck, and affirmations that I do daily. I sort of just speak my questions directly into the deck as I'm shuffling them. I just sort of put that energy into the deck. Well, that reading was pretty intense. I have a lot to think about. But right now, I'm gonna wake up Nami. I let her sleep in. We're gonna get her day started. Thank you, Elle, so much for waking up with me today.